so much. A common sign of fall, hungry bears showing up in neighborhoods and getting into garbage cans. Well, there's now a law requiring measures to discourage bears west of 25 in the springs. Bill Folsom spoke with a local man who caught on camera his prevention measures paying off. A bear known in a West Side Colorado Springs neighborhood. He's your typical bear. If you yell at him out your window or you clap your hands and say, hey, bear, move on. He's he's more scared of us than we are of him. Only he has another urge that keeps bringing him back to this garbage can. Just being a bear, doing what bears want to do, which is eat and be fat. When leaves start to turn and nights get cooler, a bear's drive to eat and be fat multiplies. For bears, your garbage is easy calories. You see him way more often in the fall. Isaac Brisk shared video of this bear partly because it's fun, but he also points out the bear is failing with his garbage can. There's several cans in my neighborhood that are bear proof that he knocks over and jumps on the front of the can and the lid pops right open. Not this one. Brisk's ingenuity that's also inexpensive is working. I think I'm $12 in for a couple good ratchet straps and wrap it strap, ratchet strap it down and across pattern and they can't get in it. An effort to outsmart bears because Brisk loves seeing wildlife. Keeping bears out of the garbage helps prevent them from getting in the kind of trouble that gets them moved or euthanized. It's just a cool thing and I think that it's real easy to keep your trash locked up and away from the bears but still be able to enjoy them. Bears figure out your trash day is their buffet day or not. This video shows it doesn't take a lot or cost a lot to frustrate a bear. Watching out for you, Colorado Springs, Bill Folsom, News 5.